Hi everyone, welcome to the, my German learning journey. Today, we're going to start for the new topic. It will be about animals. I already started to learn words, grammatical part already done in German. And I'm, I don't remember all of them, but remember most important. So yeah, let's get started. So also i want to show you something in that way maybe mm, yes here maybe i can use translate all right let's get started with the first one das tia das tia means animal so we can just pronounce it like das tia all right so we have uh, some sentences in here you can see so um yeah here das tia ist groß it means the animal is big so das is the d in this case tia is the animal and ist is is and the groß is means big the other one is das tia frisst gerne grass <clears throat> sorry the animal likes to eat grass <clears throat> so the animal likes frisst gerne likes to eat i mean gerne grass all right yeah this is first one that we already completed so if you want we can check it with translate Let's look for the first one. Yep, in here. You can just check it. Animal is big, as you see. The second one is that one. Animal likes to eat grass. Yeah, this is another one. Let's continue with the second one. The hund. The hund. Hund is dog. That, in this case, is representing the male. As you see, das is nutter for the nutter, and the animal is in this case the nutter. You can think like that. That is using for the um, male, and the d for the female, or the like multi multiple. I just forget to tell in a way that maybe I can check. Um, all right anyway so i will check it later so the hund the dog the hund belt loud the dog the dog barks loudly loud is in this case loudly it's not different than uh, english belt is barks just this one is a little different yeah, as you see in here right so okay belt loud the dogs, the dog barks loudly. The hund belt loud. And the other one is mein, mein Nachbar, mein Nachbar hat einen Hund. My neighbor has a dog. As you see, Nachbar is something like neighbor. Okay? Neighbor, Nachbar. Hat einen, hat means is has in this case. Einen Hund. Einen is one in this case. Um, as you see, uh, we use here einen. Why it is not ein? <coughs> Sorry, ein. It is einen. Why we use that? So let's think about that, okay? It is another important point. You can think about it. Why it is einen, not ein. Let me check with the translate. My neighbor is has a dog. Yeah, you can think. My Nachbar, I, uh, my, my Nachbar had einen Hund. Yeah. Let's continue with the third one. We already done with this. Good. The wolf. So, as you see, this the wolf like that. Let's put click in here. So the wolf is the wolf in here. 
it's the again representing the male part the wolf held in the night the wolf howls at night yeah good the wolf left in wild the wolf lives in the forest in the forest forest is wild it's coming maybe from wild i'm not sure like from wild life <laughs> leaped is <clears throat> leaped is lives leaves sorry in this case you can just match with them each other all right let's continue with the de fox the fox the fox means by the way yes i remember now therefore the masculine and does for another and the d for the feminine and uh sometimes it is for uh don't remember again sorry okay when i remember as now like now i will tell you the force let me take my pencil the force had einen buschigen schwanz all right it says the fox has a boozy boozy tail boozy i don't know how to use this one so the force had einen as you see the fox has a this case einen buschigen schwanz schwanz is tail and buschigen is busigen or busigen have uh, here it's bushy busy like that this one the force schleicht schleicht sich an schleicht means is sneaks up sneaks and sich an means like up in this case sich so the force schleicht sich an the fox sneaks all right i hope you get it let's check it with the translate and continue let's look for the first one all right wow i was check also in turkish this word uh bushigan by the way all of them now different uh not english english yeah Mm-hmm. Yeah, busy. Not tail, but yeah, I was thinking about this one. Gür in Turkish. What about in English? It's busy. Wow. I I wouldn't know this one, you know. Alright. I had not know. So let's continue with the the velpe. The velpe means it's poopy. So the velpe just using like that this is a masculine so let's check the sentences the velpe is was peeled was peeled the poopy is playful was peeled means is playful in this case um was peeled and the velpe in this case as you see poopy is playful it's so easy one um yeah just do it like that the velpe schlaft feel so the poopy sleeps a lot schlaft in this case sleep feel it's a lot this one feel okay so as you see we can say the velpe schlaft feel so the poopy sleeps a lot yeah so um i hope you and you you're learning also this schlaft and the feel so sleeps a lot schlaft sleeps feel a lot good the katze all right this is feminine eh? this is cat by the way um let's check it what is the sentence the katze meow lies so as you see it's saying uh, the cat meows softly lies is softly and meow it's meows meow like that <laughs> all right katze is cat so as you see this is easy example just you can know softly is lice so the katze yacked the mouse 
So as you see, the cat chases the mouse. This is another one. We can check and translate. Let me do that. By the way, I will get my camera soon. I have issues on camera side, some technical issues. For that, I cannot show myself because I like to put myself there too for the remember in the future what I did and want to check my face. <laughs> the cat chases. I, I will check this uh, cases. Okay. So, yak the mouse. All right. It is something pursued of running like that. Yak the mouse. Let's go back to there. You already know about it. Let's put click for the cats there. And we have mouse. We already learned about mouse, I think, in here. We used mouse, this one. The mouse is same. The mouse is klein. Klein means it's small. Just you can know that. Like this one, klein, small. For example, you can say klein junge, like small child, small child or small young guys or child. The mouse frisst then case. Frisst in this case, by the way, fuck, sorry. Likes, likes is gan, I think. Yeah. Lux is gana, frist is id. Mm, okay. The mouse frist then kasse, kasse. Oh, I don't know how to pronounce it. Let, let me check that. It's saying the mouse eats the cheese. Let me check it really uh, confusing with that one. Kasse. All right. Kasse, yeah. The mouse face then kisser. The mouse eats the cheese. All right. <coughs> mouse is just mouse. Just you can know klein, frist, and frist is means eat, and the uh, means cheese. Die Ratte. Uh, come here, mouse, okay. Ratte. Die Ratte. By the way, the pronunciation is Drati. Drati. Yeah, sorry, Drati is better. Drati, it is feminine. Eh? Drati, husht. 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 Or I'm not sure. Über den Boden. The rat scurries across the floor. I'm not sure about scurries. I will check this uh, the words, means in English and in German. Husht. Über. Damn wood. But curious. No, it's okay. Um, let's delete this one. Um, the rat rust über den Boden. What is Boden? Um, Boden means it's uh, floor. Yeah, it's curious is something that I, I did not one minute yes fleets um oh mm, it's different little scamper flash scurry yeah it's a little bit different one hushin hushed yeah let me read all of the sentence in a good way let me listen that oh gerate Rust über den Boden. Boden. The rat, the rat scurries across the floor. Yeah. The rat is eine Negarat. Negarat. What is this? Nagat. It is something Indian? <laughs> I don't know. The rat is, the, the rat, the rat is a rodent species. All right, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just enjoying. <laughs> I like to make this kind of sounds. Yeah, we're not making some peel. <laughs> we're just laughing. <laughs> I know Middle Asian just <laughs> just hating from this behavior, but yeah, it comes for the European. <laughs> just laugh. <laughs> the hamster. Okay, let's go to the back to this side. Let's put a click there. 
Hamster, okay. Let's come for the hamster. The, the hamster. This is masculine. And you can see the hamster loved. Loved is run in this case. Left. Imrat. On the. Im is in this case on the. Rat is will. Yeah, will. So the hamster runs on the wheel. All right, what are you doing there, hamster? I think you're bringing some energy, electric. <laughs> left. I don't know what the pronunciation of this in these words. Let me check left, this one. Okay. Left. Okay, left means run. The hamster, the hamster, left. I'm in red. Okay. The hamster buddled Ghana in sand. Ghana is like buddled is not sure. In sand is this one digging. What what is this? <laughs> what dig? <laughs> Let me check that one. It's it looks a little bit crazy. Yeah. The hamster likes to dig into the sand. All right. <laughs> Our heart is bad. <laughs> okay, the hamster buddled Ghana in sand. Okay. Uh, I already check it. Let me take pencil. Go back to the here. Put here condition for this one. The hamster. It's done. The canin the condition. It is nether. I don't know why the rabbit is nether. You know, what is the difference between hamster? and rabbit so <laughs> they are animal i mean so why rabbit is why rabbit is nether and the uh, cat is the feminine and the hamster is the man masculine i'm not sure it is so problematic i never understand this this is something that you you must know during speaking german i will check i will research it later the scanish in hopilt by the visa rabbits hops hops is hop out you can think from there over the meadow oh what is this meadow mm. let me check it meadow all right meadow okay <laughs> Rabbits over the middle, hops over the middle, yeah. Good activity. Hoppelt über die Wiese. Wiese is middle, I think. The Scottish phrase Karotten. The rabbit eats carrots. Karotten eats carrots. As you see, frist is it. So you can really remember this Ghana. It's like frist is it. Maybe during this class you learned it. Um, which is difficult one? I can't remember good. Yeah, and you can remember gross. All right. And sorry, maybe small. Where is the small? Uh, small, small. Yeah, Klein. You can remember also Klein. Yes, guys. That's it. That's all for this class. Finish. So we already completed this part about German animals part one. We're going to learn many more words in German step by step. I already learned a grammatical part that now time to learn about the words in the German because I need to know more words to just connect them with the grammatical part to speak with the people i already making practice with some of my friends but yeah the learning is amazing process that i like it you know always thank you so much see you in another class i will be there with the motivation and i will bring my camera there i hope so